Hello today's video we have the following content. Sweet and domineering, 10 domineering CEO dramas, emotional conflicts and sweet love coexist. The reason why TV dramas with domineering CEO themes are good is that they have strong emotional conflicts, distinct character settings, sweet love stories, dreamy plot settings, and reflections have social reality. These factors work together to make this type of TV dramas popular and sought after by the audience. Today, I recommend 10 domineering CEO themed love TV dramas for everyone. 1. Shan Shan is Coming This is an urban love comedy that tells the love story of the heroine Zhu Shan Shan, played by Xiao Liang, and the domineering CEO Feng Tang, played by Zhang Han. Zhu Shan Shan is a simple and lovely girl who was recruited into Feng Tang company because of her special blood type and became Feng Tang's exclusive employee. The two gradually developed feelings while getting along, and staged a sweet and interesting love story. 2. Half Honey Half Hurt This drama tells the story of the heroine Jiang Jun, played by Bai Lu, and her childhood sweetheart Yuan Shui, played by Luo Yangtze, reuniting after many years and working together in the workplace. Jiang Jun is a kind and smart girl, while Yuan Shui is a domineering president who is cold on the surface but passionate on the inside. The two support each other in the workplace and eventually achieve success in love and career. 3. Summer of Fox The play mainly tells the interesting but witty romantic love story between the lie transmitter Miss Fox Li Yanchu, played by Tan Song Gyan, and the human lie detector White Rabbit President Gu Changs, played by Zhang Zhao. The two gradually discovered each other's strengths in their relationship and finally got together. 4. Alien Girl Jaisaya Oki This play tells the interstellar love story of the alien girl Jaisaya Oki, played by Wang Peng, and the domineering president Fang Lang, played by Suze Hickson. Jaisaya Oki met Fang Lang on Earth, and a sweet and fantasy love story unfolded between the two. 5. Don't Fall in Love with Your Boss The drama tells the story of Jin Wei, Song Zhuer, an employee of Lu Sun, Wang Zitao, who accidentally returns to the age of 18 when his career is frustrated at the age of 28, meets his boss again, and then crosses from the workplace to the campus, and then returns to the workplace, making rapid progress all the way, pursuing a successful career in love. 6. He confessed in the backlight, the drama is adapted from Ruishu Kian Liu's novel Half Yin, telling the story of the encounter in love between the cool and handsome man Li Tang, CAO Yaoning, with high IQ in martial arts and the white lotus Ru An Nianchu, Yu Yu. The two separated due to a misunderstanding five years ago, and reunited five years later, staging a romantic love story. 7. Maybe It's Love, the drama is adapted from Li Lixiang's novel of the same name, telling the love story between Wei Qing, Yan Zai, the president of Yan Mei Group, and Zhou Shi, Su Ziyanuo, a cute and strong woman. The two gradually developed feelings for each other as they got along, and finally got together. 8. Just Married, the drama is adapted from the novel Flash Marriage CEO Contract Wife on Zhang Wang. It tells the story of marriage first, love later between fashion buyer Gu Zixi, played by Wang Yuan, and black-bellied boss Yin Sichen, played by Wang Ziki. The two gradually developed feelings under the constraints of contractual marriage and finally realized true love. 9. Why Secretary Kim, the drama is adapted from the Korean comic of the same name. It tells the romantic love story between Lee Yingjin, played by Park Seo Joon, the vice president of the group who has first-class abilities in all aspects but has social defects, and is accompanying Secretary Jin Mi Xiao, played by Park Min Ying. After Secretary Kim decided to resign, Lee Yingjin discovered that she had always been secretly in love with him, so the two began a sweet love story. 10. Good Words and Free Hand the drama is adapted from the novel of the same name by Miu Fushan. It tells the story of Li Zilian, played by Luo Yangtze, the prince of the group who was originally free and sunny. Because of family changes, he fell to the bottom of his life overnight. He had to tear off the mask of hurting people and fall in love with his fiancée Suzy Ie, played by Ching Zio. After a series of misunderstandings and difficulties, the two finally got back together. The above were the recommended 10 excellent TV series with the theme of overbearing CEO and their plot introductions. I hope you like them. Next news. Beyond endorsement, Adolf and Wang Yabo's heartwarming marriage. In this digital age of information explosion, how can a brand stand out? A recent social media campaign by the national cleaning brand Adolf undoubtedly provides the answer. This discussion around the warm cooperation between celebrity spokespersons and brands is like a breeze on the social platform. 
While attracting countless eyeballs, it also allows more people to reshape the cognitive outline of Adolf's brand charm. The highlight of Adolf's action lies in its deep brand identity. The close combination of Wanyabo, a young idol, and Adolf's brand value not only enhances the image recognition of the product, but also conveys the brand's warmth to everyone who pays attention. Behind this in-depth cooperation with celebrities is Adolf's keen capture of the pulse of the times and a deep understanding of the young consumer group's desire for emotional resonance with idols. Different from traditional celebrity endorsements, Adolf chose to support Wang Yibo at a critical moment, showing the brand's firmness and responsibility, and also presenting a more vivid and practical connection between celebrities and brands. This mutual support in the face of challenges shows the brand's persistence and emphasis on character image, which meets the public's expectations for positive energy spokespersons. Not only an innovative practice and marketing strategy, this in-depth cooperation event is more like a grand event of emotional consensus. In the heated discussions have netizens, real emotional responses can be seen. Because of the bridge of common favorite stars, unprecedented connections and trust have been established between brands and consumers. The realization of brand vision is inseparable from the efforts of each individual, and the cooperation example of Adolf and Wanyabo has opened a new chapter of empathy and resonance in brand building. This event not only provides a case for other brands to learn from, but also adds a touch of warmth to the celebrity endorsement model, making people more expectant and concerned about the brand story behind the celebrity endorsement. Just as Adolf showed this time, the brand concept, choose persistence, choose warmth, and choose to go hand in hand with consumers. In the days to come, I hope that such warmth and resonance will continue to expand and extend on the road of the brand, and jointly build a broader emotional bond between the brand and users. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 